welcome to the Frederick County Public Library's virtual programming. I'm Miss Bell from Urbana Regional Library, and I'm here to have fun with you today. It is cold outside, but it is sunny and bright. So today, I'd like to make a sound catcher with water to hang it in a tree in my yard. Are you ready to have some fun? Let me tell you what you would need to make this sound catcher. A plastic container or a cake pan and an insulated lunch bag that can hold that container. You will need food coloring, a piece of string or ribbon, silicon cupcake molds, and if you don't have this um, silicon mold, you can use just small plastic containers. And you, you will need water and a small paper cup with coins or something heavy that can weigh down. We'll need some clear ice, so we are going to use this insulated lunch box. The reason we use the lunch box is to slow down the freezing process. In the water, there are minerals and other small particles we cannot see. When the water gets frozen, those particles will form bubbles, which makes the ice cloudy. If we use the lunch box to slow down the freezing process, those particles have time to escape and not trapped in the ice, so we get to have clear ice. First, um, put the mold in the cake pan, cake pan, and then fill the water only halfway. And bring this to the freezer and put it on the flat surface. Make sure that the surface is flat so the container will not be tilted. And then let's pretend this is the inside the freezer. And when after putting it down, add some water in the cake pan. And then we will close the lid. You don't have to zip it, just cover it up, and then we will leave it in the freezer for at least five hours. So I waited for about five hours, but each freezer works differently, so you have to wait until um, the water um, is frozen a little bit. So lift the lid, and if you look at that, you can see that it's a little frozen see so we're gonna put um, food coloring just one or two drops so one color for one mold don't put too much coloring because it gets really dark just one or two drops will be enough lid back on and we're gonna leave this in the freezer for at least like 10 hours so I'm gonna leave it in my freezer like overnight take out the lunch box and get the colorful ice from the mold you can either wiggle it out wiggle it out or you can use like warm water a little bit Put the ice bag in the pan. And make a spot for the cup with the coins. We're gonna put this cup with coins somewhere there. So we have to make a spot with warm water. Let me just put it here and then we're going to add some water.
put it the lunch bag in the freezer. Then after a while, add more water and freeze it again. Repeat this until the surface becomes smooth and nice. Get the cake pan out and keep it at room temperature for a few minutes or until it begins to loosen up. Remove the coins. And use warm water to loosen up. Remove the sun catcher from the cake pan. Loop a string or ribbon through the hole. Ta-da! Hang it outside and enjoy! It's fun to watch the sun catcher melt in the sun or maybe you can guess how long it will take to disappear. Thank you for watching the Frederick County Public Library's virtual programming and come back for another great programming soon. Goodbye!